All right, we're getting ready to clean some carpets with the Dupre Neat, which is right there heating up. And we have some stains we're going to pre-treat. Where's the red? Is that it? That's it. Okay, there's the bleach stuff there is not going to come out. But the red stain, we're going to go ahead and spray that. Ammonia and? 20 volume. About 20 volume, yep. It's going to get treated like a king. Oh, I see fading already, so. And then there goes the peroxide. The peroxide really went to town on there it goes. When it foams up like that, that's a good sign the peroxide's gonna. Oh, some vacuum well. Yeah. There's debris. That's all right. All right. This is this is one little room. Yeah, they never vacuum very good. And I'll show you the other little room we're doing. We're trying to keep this video at a reasonable length. Yeah. There's some. These are dark stains, and they already faded quite a bit. Now that one's turning blue, so that may not come out. Sometimes they will, sometimes they won't. We'll see how they react to the steam. This I think is, it just turned from blue this to is, This is a spot too. I think it just went from blue to blue green. There's a spot right there too. Uh -uh. That looks like worn carpet. It's a gouge, but it's... Well, we'll treat it anyway, because we're charging for it. Uh, All right, the rest of it's just basic pre-spray. Nothing fancy. It's like 190 degrees outside today, so... And this place has a very, very weak air conditioner. And we're getting ready to steam the joint up, so it's going to be really wonderful in here. I'll say it now, it's like a sauna in here. It's going to be some jolly good times. So stay tuned, we get this thing to, ready to go and we'll start the video back up. Alright, as promised, the bleach stains didn't budge because they never do. The red stain's gone. Gone? In gone 60 in 60 seconds. seconds. Yeah. Oh, there you go. Shut the door behind you and let's start the steamers. I think I'll spin her in a little bit. Alright. <clears throat> and we did find a faint red stain out here in the field. It's right in there. Is it, is it gone? It's gone. Well good, that's the best kind of charge for <laughs> yeah. the kind where you spray and they take off. Well if we have to put down a, a, if we have to treat the stain especially, besides our general pre-spray, we charge for that. It's getting charged. Alright, the green light's still on. Okay, so on the Dupre Need, a lot of people say that the light turns amber all the time and so it's, it's, uh, it's not maintaining heat. The green light means that it's stopped uh, heating because it's heated to the maximum temperature. When the amber light is on, it just means that it's heating the, the, the water in the boiler. And it's going to stay amber while you're using it. You don't have to, on carpets, you don't have to let off the trigger. You can just keep going if you want to. Now, we were cleaning a shower earlier today, which was not video worthy. <laughs> and on those, you do want to let it build up here and there because you're, the nozzle we was using, we were using for that, it lets some of the steam, it lets the steam escape a lot faster. I'll tell you, people who've been out cleaning the shower yet, it ain't fun to do. No, we got one. It was really, really old soap scum that's been in there for years, and uh, steam wasn't enough for that. We had to scrape it. But uh, uh, if you do clean showers, charge people about two hundred bucks. Don't be cheap on it. Do no fifty, sixty bucks. No, because it's a lot more it's work than you think it's going to be. Work. You need to get a good. You need to get some good scrapers like paint scrapers and, and uh, floor scrapers and things like that because a lot of that soap scum is only going to come off yeah, if you Yeah, you're going to be doing a lot of scraping. All right. That's for sure. Back to the neat. It's rated at 275 degrees at 50 PSI and it heats up and you fill it up and it heats up in under 10 minutes generally and you have 50 minutes of trigger time. So, you know, if you're messing around doing lots of things, when you squeeze that trigger, that counts on your time and you'll get about 50 minutes. And you could do a whole lot of work in 50 minutes. Oh yeah. You can do a whole house, a car, like a three or four bedroom home. Yeah. Now we don't show it cleaning a lot of other things because we basically clean carpets and upholstery and sometimes floors. So, you know, if you look on our channel, all of the videos we have in the need are mostly carpet cleaning. But carpet cleaning is one of the things that uh, people don't think about with a steamer. Uh, it doesn't, you know, it's not the first thing you think of. But they actually do a really good job because they penetrate down to the nap. Uh, the mat of the carpet and they bust loose everything that's down there because that's and you'll see the pad uh, this case a towel that we put on there it's going to start getting darker in well, use. Well the secret to this is you do a very good vacuum and you get out all your drops of your sand, your grit, your dirt you get that out with a vacuum cleaner and then when you start steaming all you're cleaning is the carpet fibers because the uh, the dirt's... Oh never pull it by the hose no. like you just did. I that's pull it. But the that's dirt, bad for the, the connection. you do a good vacuum and if you do a good vacuuming, you get all the heavy stuff out, then all you got to do with this is strip the carpet fibers. Yeah. And 
and the good thing about it, it, it shoots down into the bottom of the carpet mat or the mat, and it uh it vaporizes like Pepsi, Coca Cola, that kind of stuff. Any of that stuff that's in there is going to get converted to steam and just go up into atmosphere. Yeah, it gets up. Uh it gets out traffic lanes and stuff really good. Oh, yeah. Yeah, it does. And it does a good job of fluffing your carpets back up. So that steam, it really does a good job revitalizing carpets. And it's really good in traffic areas or matted down areas. <clears throat> I'm going to pause here because we're trying to keep the video length down. And there's not much to see. We are going to rake the carpets. We have a carpet rake. We're going to rake the carpets when we get done. And I'll show you how this room looks when we get it raked. So stay tuned. All right, there's the Grand Groom carpet rake that we used. We just raked this. I'm gonna turn the ceiling fan off. And it looks pretty good. It is a worn out carpet. There's a lot of wear here at the threshold, but we got it fluffed up. He's already on, on the job here. Let me kind of hold that door, man. It's getting all right. It was working first. It didn't do this till just now. Well, maybe the steam loosened it up. <laughs> yeah, you can see by the the way the carpet fibers look. This carpet's pretty trashed. Yeah, but it's cleaning up. It's turning shiny. Those fibers have unraveled. Is what's happened. They've unraveled from wear. And no, it's just they're not it's not gonna look like good carpet when you get done. It's gonna have that you know, the ripple effect and stuff from all the that's just strands instead of actual twisted fibers, that's just strands of carpet. It's, it's like split ends when you get your hair yeah. messed up. It's the same. Alright, now this stain here, the turn blue, may not come out. And uh, that happens sometimes, it could be some ink or something. You never know. It's a lot of tattoo artists living around here. Probably not. Huh? Yeah, doing their jailhouse tattoos. And the ones that with no license? That yeah. Spreading the, hepatitis all over the city? That's right. And yeah. they, get, they get ink in the carpets and you, the you can't get it out. Let's see. Okay, so we're going to town here. And you can clean continuously, which is nice. The Dupre Neat, um, I'll put a link in the video description so you can go buy one direct from us. I also put a link to our Amazon Influencer store, and we've got, uh, shoot, almost 3,000 items currently for sale there. We sell a lot of other steamers there too. We have a whole section for steamers. So if you're wanting to get something that move maybe this, can move this over this way about. Oh, that, that's good. So if you're wanting to get something that can uh, basically run all day, where you can keep filling it up. We've got steamers that do that. This steamer here, you can run it for 50 minutes. Then you need to let it cool down for a half hour or so before you can open the cap. And then you can put some more water in there and start heating it back up again. That takes about 10 minutes. So if you go over your time, you will have to uh, shut down for a few minutes. The blue steam. It's not going to come out, I don't think. It's coming out a lot. Hopefully by the time it's raked, you won't really be able to tell it's By there. the time I'm done, it... oh, look at that. Now some of these stains are mature, they, they will come back. When the carpet fully dries, they just reappear, so you can never tell sometimes. Blue stains can be tricky. It ain't coming back. Green stains can be tricky. But anyway, uh, we've got, uh, we sell electric truck mounts, we sell really large portables. If you want to use, if you want to go that way, we sell lots of chemicals. Uh, let's see, we've got ProCam, we've got, uh, I think it's CTI Pro's Choice. Um, Shoot, there's another, there's another, I can't remember the name of it. We've got Harvard Chemicals. We've got a lot of chemicals for sale in our store. And we've got them categorized so it's easy to kind of track things down. But uh, we, we also sell a whole lot of fitness equipment. So if you want a, uh, Come over here. If you want a leg press machine for your house, or a hack squat machine, or you want a uh, Smith uh, system. Uh, if you want that, that blue stain was, it was this big, and now it's like... Yeah, it's, it's shrunk down a little. You can't even truly see it. It's it, called, it's, it's been reduced. Majorly. But check our Amazon, I'll put the link for the Amazon Influencer Store. Check it out, we've got lots of interesting things. We're always adding new items. We sell a lot of t-shirts and a lot of uh, just gift ideas and things like that. 
Here's yep. what it looked like. And here's what it looks like now. So it's picking up dirt. Yeah. These carpets aren't real dirty, but they are real worn out. They're always dirtier than they look. <clears throat> now one thing that's nice about, <coughs> excuse me, about steaming, if you have a place that's got fleas or bed bugs or anything else, dust mites, this will basically kill those things off. Uh, anything over 140 degrees can kill them on contact. And this is 275, so if you hit those things, they're going to know about it. But not for very long. Not that we, uh, no, we don't do exterminating ourselves. Like no, we don't, we don't, we don't even mention treatments we're, as we're far not, as. We're not licensed exterminators. No, we don't do that. But if you want but one it is for a your side home, benefit. if you want one for your home, because you've got bed bugs or something, uh, that's an ongoing issue, this will kill bed bugs. And fleas. Oh yeah, like if your dog goes out and brings the fleas in every day and. This will help with that. And you can use these steamers to clean their bedding, and uh, you can clean your... They do a real good job cleaning uh, upholstered furniture. They're super fast, and, you're, and you don't get your furniture soaking wet, so... Yeah, you, you can clean your own bedding as well. Yeah, if you clean your, uh, if you clean your sofa with this, uh, a lot of times you can just sit down on it as soon as you're done, and it's dry. Yeah. And these carpets will actually be dry. Uh, a lot of times they're dry about as fast as you go over them, but for sure within 10 or 15 minutes they'll be dry again. The only reason these carpets will be wet at all is because of the pre spray we put down. Yeah. That'll and we're dry. vaporizing that. But. That'll dry completely and then they'll be bone dry. Yeah, we always put down a pre spray. You don't have to have a pre spray to clean with steam, but we do it because it's part of what we charge for. So the pre spray goes down and then we just vaporize it. Now, if someone wants me to do a total no pre spray thing, they're, they're, they're into the whole green cleaning deal. We'll vapor clean with no yeah, a lot of customers are sensitive about any smell whatsoever, and they do not want any chemicals used. So. Move that forward, uh, sir. Don't pick it up; just slide it. It's got wheels. Uh, well, for being 195 degrees outside, the uh, it's starting to look like it's getting a little cloudy. So maybe we'll get lucky. Maybe we'll get lucky. Maybe we'll get lucky and we'll get. Home. Yeah, 195 oh, degree water. Trying to drive around. Yeah, it might be more comfortable than this uh, high heat and humidity we got today. Well, the thing about the rain is it's neat until the next day when it's very, very Yeah, it's just going to make it worse. Yeah, it's going to make it more humid. You, you suffer for it. It's usually dry weather here. It doesn't rain very much, but this is the middle of July. Well, not quite the middle, but. Uh, this time of year is kind of wishy-washy. It may rain a little bit here and there, and then the next day you're going to pay for it. But uh, most of the summers are really hot and dry here, so actually being outside even at 110 degrees is not very uncomfortable because you're not going to sweat. But, oh, and as you all can see, this isn't a real slow deal. I mean, I'm going through these rooms pretty fast, so if you can see how fast. I mean, they're getting clean. And this is about as fast as you can go on most rooms. If they're real dirty, you may slow down just a wee bit. But... I've done some pretty dirty ones and I've done them pretty quick and got them clean too, so yeah, it's definitely a... I'll put a uh, link for the playlist that we have for these Dupre Neats and you can see if you want to go through there, you can see a lot of the other carpets we've cleaned and it, it does a real good job like taking out gum. If you have gum in your carpet that's been sitting there for a while or even fresh, it just pulverizes it and, and it disintegrates it, so it's a real good way to get out uh, gum and candle wax and things like that. And the other nice thing about this is uh, you can clean everything in your house basically with them. Now there's a lot of uh, things you can't really clean as good as maybe the infomercials and stuff sometimes okay. show. One more time to blue. Yeah, I think it's done for. I'm calling. There, I, I think I barely see a speck. <laughs> and it's a speck. And I'm not going to go too much more on it. But it's out. All right, that's I'm gonna pause the camera. Call it complete success. We gotta put all this away, and I gotta rake these carpets, and I'll show you the final results. So, stay tuned. All right, <clears throat> get ready, get out. Carpets are raked, and they came out looking okay. This area up here has been raked, but the carpet. The fibers are deteriorated so bad that you can't really make it look that great. It's not going to survive. Once people start moving in and walking on it, it's going to take a minute or two and it's going to look like garbage because you can't fix damage by cleaning. All right.
you can see this, you can see by how they did this over here, this whole apartment was kind of trashed, so that was the patch job they tried to make. Now you can't really tell how these are doing in the long run because I took out a gray stain for someone in one of these one time at, back at Christmas. It's still gone, a, 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 a traffic lane, a heavy traffic lane. It came out and it's not coming back in because I see the guy all the time. Alright, let's see. Yeah, we just put everything in a big tote. Like that. Just gotta be careful you don't let the hose get messed up where it comes out of the machine. And then we just got a cart. Yeah, you can't get close you can't get any close parking over here, so you have to have a cart or something to move around. Anyway, check the video description uh, for the links I mentioned. And please like, comment, and subscribe. Until next time, thanks for watching.